Isaiah chapter 29, verse 6, and it reads, Thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts with thunder and with earthquake and great noise, with storm and tempest and the flame of devouring fire. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash, next double honors to the head apostles, slash elder bishops of Great Millstone, the one that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible. Peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere Akims. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith. Regardless of people here, forbear. You got earthquakes, you got storms, you got floods, you got volcanoes popping off. You look, crime, violence, chaos. Uproars of the people, all in time prophecies. See, see, this is the job of a prophet. You see, this is the job of a man, a prophet of the Lord, a man. All right, it's a man's job to teach this blessed word. Once again, it's a man's job, not a one man's job. It's a man's job to teach the blessed word, to warn you, Israelites. What's going to happen before they have, look, should there be evil in the city and the Lord having all kind of break-ins, all kind of spoilings? Just look, just, 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 just thieves, every day. They, they ain't playing no more, man. It's just crazy. Look, look, we're at the end of an age for real, for real. And, and look how it's going down. Ain't no love nowhere. Why? Because the wicked is ruling the earth. But, but, you, but you see it, 1,500 earthquakes in Iceland. Within 24 to 48 hours, sign of the times. See, shouldn't have to keep writing until you what time it is. You should know already. Knowing, knowing then that all these things should be dissolved. What manner of person are we to be? How should we be conducting ourselves seeing, seeing how the Lord's going forth throughout the four corners of the earth? With, look, with his wrath, thou shall be visited of the Lord of hosts. And then I, then I, um, the brother of Ra, he did this um, seven hours ago, right? But then I looked up this, I looked at this article, listen to this, Iceland, home to hundreds of volcanoes, has been hit with more than 2,000 earthquakes in the, in the last few days. 2,000 earthquakes in a couple of days? Look, the Lord ain't playing, let's get, let's get that scripture again. While, while these other Israelite groups are, are playing Shakespeare, why they? Why these other Israelite group leaders are playing Shakespeare, <clears throat> like they in a, in a Hollywood movie? Oh yeah, everything's going digital. Everything, everything, pretty much see hip ready. Only thing they need to do is make make a FF happen. You you know what we mean by that? Do I need to spell it out? F A L S E, F L A G. A FF. Only thing it's gonna take is another major FF, like no, so like in two thousand. The nine, the big nine slash one slash one, if you know what I mean. Isaiah 29 and 6, thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts, the Lord of armies, Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, who you ignorantly call God and Jesus. Look, look, not, not, they're not nice guys. They're not nice guys with thunder and what comes out the thunder, lightning. And we know you Israelites tired of these scriptures. But don't watch the video. That, that's all. Don't watch the video. It's just simple as one, two, three. Don't watch the video. You tired of the, hearing the same message over and over and over? Look, look, don't watch the video and just wait on judgment. That's all you got to do. That's all you Israelites got to do. It ain't hard. Just ignore the video. Look, look, there's a whole lot of folly on the internet. You got twerking going on. You, you got people putting on makeup. You got, you got kids dancing. You got kids holding up blinkies. You got, you got birthday parties. You got people just uh, folly and setting quick dignity. Just go watch them videos. You see? You know? Just go watch. You got, you got um, cats, you know what I'm saying? Meowing. You little dogs barking. Go watch something else if you don't want to hear about the end time prophecies. And with earthquake. And we just showed you over 2,000 earthquakes in a, in a um, couple of days, hour period, man. 20, 48, 28 hour period, things of that nature. That's a lot of earthquakes, man. And then volcano, you got 19 volcanoes, then, then erupted at, at the same time. And great noise with storm and tempers and the flame of the very fire. So as soon as I've seen this video, you already know what it is. Did, did my own little research and then look, let's just go in. 1,500 earthquakes, but now we just read that account. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's over 2,000 now. That's over 2,000 now. Vo little volcano evic evacuations. It was like 19 volcanoes erupt at the same time the other day. It, it, it's really going down. 
Plus the Lord said, think not that I come to send peace on earth. I came not to send peace, but I swore to just get that right quick. For all the Israelites think, <clears throat> for all the Israelites that still think we're living in peaceful times, and you can just keep playing around, ignoring the words. All, all right, I got, I got a scripture for you. I got, I got a scripture for you. For all the Israelites that think it's all peace and lovely, you see, uh, we're, we're living in a time where you, where you can go back to college, you see, you can go be an actor, you can go be a rapper and all that other BS. You got to be out of your mind to even think about trying to go back into the world and, and do anything, you see? Get your day, get your regular job, get your daily bread, you know what I'm saying? Pay them down bills, pay your tithes, and, and look, until the Lord come, you see? Until this destruction come, and, and pray that we're kind of worthy to escape all these things. Sing Matthew chapter 10, verse 34, and it reads, Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. Because that's what everybody thinking. That's what the pastors in the church is pushing, you know? That's what that's what the majority of these Israelite group leaders are pushing, pushing, you see? Peace, uh, build community ties, you see, and, and all this other nonsense, you know, getting 501c3 charters because they, they don't think the Lord going to come no time soon. But but this scripture right here is jumping off the pages, though, right? St. Matthew 10, 34, think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I came not to send peace, but a sword, and that sword represents destruction, a whole lot of deletion. All thing you got to do is turn on the news. The, the things that are written the full time are written for our learning. That we through patience that cover other scriptures might have hope. Amos chapter 3, verse 6, shall the trumpet be blown in the city and the people not be afraid? Shall there be evil, meaning bad times in the city? And look, look, shall there be evil in the city and the Lord have not done it? So everything you see going on is being controlled by the Lord. The Lord had his hand in it. All right. The Lord had his hand in it, man. Yeah, yeah, bridges collapsing. All kind of car wrecks throughout the night. People got deleted all throughout the night. Got bang outs. People are banging at the, at the popo. Now they, look, look, but people ain't, the Lord got them spirits created within. They, they, they out there, man. They, those spirits created within, they, they're out there. Teeth of wild beasts, fires, famine, oh, earthquakes, all those are spirits created within these hell storms. You, you name it, man. And the Israelites that don't take heed, you, you're you going to get caught smack dead in the middle. It is just something quick. I seen the video yet um, last night. In the wee hours, I said, I said when I wake up, Lord willing, I'm going to do something on it right quick. Isaiah 45 and 7. Just look, just a quick update. It's a quick update. Seek the Lord. Isaiah chapter 45 verse 7. I form the light and create darkness I make peace and create evil, meaning the bad times. I, the Lord, Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, who you ignorantly call God and Jesus, by way of the angels, do all these things. So, so it's the Lord that orchestrated this right here. 1,500 earthquakes in Iceland within 24 hours. Look, look, ground care. I'm going to play a little bit of it. Let's play a little bit of it if I can. It's the power of the Lord make the ground crack. It's the power of the Lord, Israel. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the you know, this just broke the whole damn ground apart, man. And Jake's don't fear that. Praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechakwadash. And that's all praises to the Heavenly Father, through the name of the only begotten Son, through the Holy Spirit. Double honors to the apostles, bishops, and elders of Great Millstone for teaching up. And I'm looking at the news right about now. Matthews Creek Fire in Virginia, worries residents burning three thirty six hundred 
plus acres right now. So you got fires going on. You got earthquakes going on. You got storms going on. You got floods going on. You got violence and chaos going on. Isaiah chapter 45 verse 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, once again, who you ignorantly call God and Jesus, do all these things, man. It is a fearful thing to follow. That's why we give you warning. The Lord said, give them warning. Seek the Lord now, man. Matter of fact, yeah, we, we, we get this right. I, I, I get I get two more scriptures, Lord willing, and then, then I'm gonna roll out Ezekiel three and seventeen. Just keep warning. It it doesn't matter if they don't if they take heed or not. It don't matter. Our job we can't make you listen. We can't make you take heed. Our only job is to teach this blessed word, and that's it, man. Ezekiel 3 and 17, son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel, a people before us a place. Therefore, hear the word of my mouth and give them warning from me. So the only thing the prophet's job is to give you warning. It's, it's up to the Lord to put his spirit on you to take heed. The Israelites that don't take heed, the scriptures say all the unfaithful shall die in the unfaithfulness. This, this, this book is real. You see? This book is real. Look, look, somebody got banged at McDonald's. You can't even go eat a burger. This this was yesterday. Somebody got banged at McDonald's. Look, it's really going down. A little de desperate times calls for desperate measures. These people are up on a whole lot of pressure. They can't pay their rent. Shit, rent then went up out of the damn roof. R rent just jumped out of the roof. Rent, rent jumped out of the roof. You see? Yeah, they light bill outrageous. They had um child care is outrageous. People gotta make life making decisions when they go to the grocery store. Do, do I buy this chicken, you know what I'm saying? Or do I pay my light bill? Do I, do I buy this um who knows what you people buy when you go to the grocery store? Should I buy these items right here or should I pay my gas bill? If if I get this item right here, then I'm only gonna be able to put five dollars of gas in the car and then and I only got five dollars somewhere. Don't complain now. You got all kind of people complaining about how hard it is. You, look, everybody wanted to be independent. Everybody, look, look, you, you got it. Uh, look, remember, uh, you can do you because I'm going to do me. Remember all that? that? And that shit starting to hit the fan now. You see? Jeremiah chapter 28, verse 8. The prophets that have been before me and before thee of old prophesied. They told you what was going to happen before it even happened. Both against many countries and against great kingdoms of war and of evil and of pestilence. And that's the job of a prophet. So, yeah, just a quick reminder. I'm saying it, it, it don't stop. It don't stop. Look, look, can't stop. Won't stop. The Lord going to keep it coming. Remember, great miseries. Iceland, home of hundreds of, of volcanoes, has been hit with more than 2,000 earthquakes in the last few days, prompting the country to declare a state of emergency and evacuations over a potential volcano eruption, putting the safety of thousands at risk. Look, look, look perilous times. Per look, per perilous times, man. You see? More than 800 earthquakes have been recorded in the country since Friday.